Oh, I think it starts to change. It changes the sort of dynamic, doesn't it? It changes the feel of, of carnival. So um, I think that's quite a, an interesting and challenging proposal. Um, but it is quite packed. I mean, I, to be honest, I haven't been to, to Carnival Notting Hill for a, for a little a little while. Um, I remember sort of when I was younger. I mean, you didn't go for a year without going to going to Notting Hill Carnival. As I've got older, I tended tended not to go. Um, but I think we should be proud of our carnival history mm. um, in this country and the, and the heritage that it that it signifies. It's amazing. Well, I go every year. Do I, have, you? I have to go. It's just yeah. one of these things. It's part of the culture. And I feel like if I if you don't go. It's something missing. There's some, still something really nice about going there and seeing friends that you, you just don't see throughout the year. And you bump into them, and you won't see them anywhere else, but you bump into them at Carnival. And that's that whole social thing that's really good around it. And yeah, yeah no, but it's, it's changing, you can see. Yeah, it, yeah. It's, it's important. I mean, it's an art form that we've got to support yeah. and that we should take really mm, seriously. Because yeah. I mean, it engages with, with yeah. so many people. And I see my mum's friends who still go, they have their corners at Atrium, that corner, and they. I was going past this year, and they're all still there. They're older now, but they still go. It's like a tradition for them, and they go every single year, and they have their spot. Maybe in a way, it's, the, it's kind of the, as the generations born in, in the UK, and the, the connection between, say, like the first generation, is because they're most of them are dying now, and they're most of them have died. But you've got people who are parents have been born in England, and that connection with the Caribbean is getting more and more distant, and I think that's something that holds on to that yeah, um, that that culture heritage of the uh, Caribbean. And if you lose that, with that the, gener the old generation, a lot of them have died and uh, are now dying, and they can reach that age, then that connection between them and the Caribbean has been lost. And I think if we lose that, then we've lost a massive connection to our heritage. It's quite interesting art forms like they, they do two things though, don't they? So they, they provide that connection across mm. the across the generations. I, I'm second generation. I was. I was born in the mid mid fifties in London, but they've also got to move and sort of and, and make sure that they're staying relevant to, to now. the younger yeah, to, yeah, to, yeah. to the younger generations mm. now. So it's called that balancing act. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Is, is a challenge. Yeah.